Eevee is a rare spawn, but it's a Pokemon that you can get super early in the game. In this video, I'm going to show you where Eevee spawns and what you can do to increase your chances of getting more Eevees to spawn, and we're getting started right now. So Eevee is a rare spawn, and we know this by looking at the Pokedex. We can see that this little dude lives near towns and cities, and it's rarely seen. Now, if you take a look at the map, you can see the bright orange areas where Eevees spawn. However, we're going to be focused on this little area right here. It's located on the west side of Cortando. And the reason that we're looking here is because it's very easy to get there in the early game, but it's also easy to get there even if you're in the late game, because you can just fly there and start hunting. However, if you're looking for a higher level Eevee, then I suggest you take a look a little farther north in the area right here. Okay, so once I made my way over to Cortando West, I started looking in the area right around the light-colored fields on the map. These fields are essentially surrounded by a little fence, so it's pretty easy to know that you're looking in the right area. So for me, I'd basically run up and down the fence line on the top portion of the field until they would spawn. However, I could not get these little dudes to spawn in, and so I started researching and trying to find a better way to make Eevee spawn into the game. Now, Eevees are a normal type Pokemon, and I knew that sandwiches will boost the encounter power for certain Pokemon types. So, I started looking for sandwiches that would boost the encounter power for normal Pokemons. I found that the ham sandwich would do the trick. Hey guys, if you're finding this video helpful, then be sure to hit the like button. Okay, so I went to the sub shop in Cortando West, and I figured that the sandwich would be there so that I could just simply purchase it from the shop, but it wasn't there. So then I started trying to figure out the ingredients to make a ham sandwich myself. Turns out, you only need four ingredients. You need ham, mayo, mustard, and pickles. So I jumped over to Cortando East and checked out the shops there. The Artisan Bakery did have the ham, the mayo, and the mustard, but of course they don't sell the pickles. I actually found the pickles halfway across the map in a town called La Vincia. The pickles are sold at the Sure Can store in La Vincia North. Now, when you spawn in, the shop is over towards the right if you're facing your player. So I bought a bunch of pickles and made my way back to Cortando West. Okay, so now that I have all of the ingredients for the ham sandwich, it's time for a picnic. And to make the sandwich, it's pretty easy. You just walk up to the table, you hit A on your controller, and you can choose which sandwich that you want to make based on the ingredients that you have in your inventory. So I chose the ham sandwich. And after the cutscene of eating the ham sandwich, you can see that you've been given the boost for encounter power for normal type Pokemons. Leave me a comment below and let me know what your favorite evolution is. Now, just keep moving up and down the fence line in the Cortando West area until you get one to spawn. Now for me, it took maybe about five minutes maximum after I had eaten the sandwich. Before that, I could not get them to spawn in at all, no matter what I tried. Also, if you're having an issue getting them to spawn, then try eating more sandwiches. Just by repeating the process of eating the sandwiches and running up and down this area, I was able to get about 10 Eevees in about 20 minutes of time. And finally, the next step is to subscribe and then check out my next Pokemon Scarlet and Violet video. 